So this video is going to be about basically how I design this model in Fusion 360s and basically it's a film uh, basically a 120 film slide where you can pull the 120 film inside of this slot and take a photo and from there you will be able to have it take a photo through your cell phone or your camera but this is mainly for cameras I didn't want to do it for a cell phone because I do not want to do it for cell phone right now I just wanted to do it for cameras and this is a 120 film and you probably wondering how you pull the the film in it it's pretty much simple basically to insert the film you will just insert the film through here through this part first of all you have to develop the film it's you can only do a negative films and stuff like that but you just insert the film the 120 film here and hook your camera on the back here and you definitely need a camera mount to mount it to your Canon, Nikon, Fuji whatever Sony camera you have and have the lights coming through here and basically through here and from there now you can take the photo inside I mean take the photo so you probably wondering the holes the holes will be covered that's why I have the cover here on top here it's a extra so you can adjust this part where you you can just push it if you want it to have closer or further so you just have the options to push it up or push it down and you will see here it will fit properly everything will fit and basically it's the design I did for fusions and I'll just to show you the schematics and stuff like that a quick overlook a quick overlook and dimensions was done it correctly I did the dimension correctly and there's more involved there's a lot of I mean it's it's not everything because I did I, I did some couple change on it too so I can show you what I did the touch on because it's it's a project and yeah and you probably wonder what I have here I have nothing so I when I was modeling I just designed the body first body second body third bodies and put it under components and from there now I just move it to body like you can see I have body one to body body nine so I started I have like different I have about like nine body and all those body was added to be like this so there's like more stuff involved and there's a lot of cuts and stuff like that it's, it's not the full schematic but it's what I did so far and this is my my own design to the film that I will be sliding my 120 films and this can be printed at home if you have a 3d printer you can definitely 3d print and right now I'm I'm about to 3D print this right now. It's printing right now on my Endo, th my my Endo 3 right now, and I'm just waiting to test it out. And this is the first try after the rough design and slicing and just running. So I'm printing right now. And this is it, guys. This is it. 
this is my my design for fusions and yeah guys okay need to change it to this one okay much better now so this is this design so it's a quick setup and you put your camera my right back here slide the mount you tie it to you circle it to your camera and from there now you can take a photo of your camera have your camera mounted to basically have the camera mounted mounted to it have it and just take a photo with it so it's it's very it's very is it's, it's easy less less stuff to carry around and you don't have to use a big scanner and if you're shooting as on on your camera and you're shooting your raw basically you should be able to have every single details i mean scanning it as well is good but shooting it raw with high megapixel will give you much stuff to basically to like edits later on gonna add colors and stuff like that depending on the type of film that you can be using as well so this is a design I did and this is not the only one I did I did a 120 film slider so let me show you so basically I design my own sliding like this one like you can see on this photo how they have the the film where they pull 120 films or pull like 35 mil mil films on it and just take a photo of it and just scanning it so i designed it to the point where i have it like this and instead of having something like here where you can hook your camera I have something like here where you can basically mount it and just push it slide down take a photo push it down slide down take a photo push it down slide down take a photo so it's just continuous and this is another project that I did and I haven't finished it yet and it's very 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 involving this is another samples how the guy did his where he's taking a photo like this but mine is very involving more designing so he's taking he's scanning a negative and this is a negative as well this is for only negative 120 films and yeah guys so this is it and I don't want to spend a lot of time talking about it and just explaining it if you definitely want to know how I did it and how I draw the stuff like that or if you either want to do something like that in the future or something like that you just let me know and I will work with you yeah Thank you.